And those who knew Kosak paint the picture of a man who was always asking for money. Now, customers of what was then Salino's Pizza, they're going to change the name on the front here soon, have been telling us about being overcharged since last year. Elvin Kosak is accused of overcharging customers by hundreds of dollars while he owns Salino's Pizza. Benjamin Lovick and his wife bought the restaurant and inherited its reputation. Everybody that comes in here has something to say about how I was charged or a friend of mine was charged. According to a 15-page arrest report, Kosak told Secret Service agents he had a lot of debt from the business and gambling. Lovick, a former delivery driver for the restaurant, tells me Kosak was always asking for money. Here's my house. I'll give you the deed to my house if you can loan me, you know, $60,000. Kosak allegedly had his employees purchase and send money grams to Costa Rica to pay off the gambling debt. And those who know him say there's no one he wouldn't ask for help. I'm a local homeless person, and Elvin came and found me at Cessary Park and offered me $10 to send some money for him. Tyler Strunk says Kosak told him the money was for one of his investments. Do you feel used? Yeah, hell yeah. Yeah. I, I mean, I'm out here just trying to, to eat and, and survive, and he took advantage, and I, now I feel like I'm guilty of a crime. After no one answered at his home on Tuesday, I called Kosak. How much do you owe? He wouldn't agree to be recorded and said there was a story behind his arrest. Kosak wouldn't tell me what it was and said he was hiring a lawyer. Now, Salino's Pizza now goes by Four and Benji's Restaurant and Pizzeria. The owners tell me the restaurant's menu is expanding and they're planning a grand reopening on New Year's Eve. Kevin Clark, CBS 47, Fox 30, Action News Jax.